I met Henry in 6th grade. I was only 12. So was he. He seemed innocuous at first. Just a tall, lanky, nerdy, lanky, lanky white boy. We had a mutual friend. He had some more interests. So I thought, why not? Why not be friends with this kid? How bad could it be? Why do I sound like I'm foreshadowing something? Why do I always think in rhetorical questions? If only I knew. Waterboarding. Humiliation. Screaming at me. Waterboarding. Death. Death again. Framing me for his crimes. Allergic reaction. Waterboarding. I keep coming back to the waterboarding thing, but seriously, Henry, what the fuck is with the waterboarding? It wasn't even fake! You actually waterboarded me! What the fuck is wrong with you? And you laughed at me afterwards! What the fuck? Well, it won't matter soon. I can only bend so much before I break. Now it's time for Henry to finally feel the pain I felt all this time. You might be asking, why didn't I say something? Why didn't I stand up for myself? If I actually talk to Henry about how I feel, why can't I stop thinking in rhetorical fucking questions? Classic. Oh, hi Jeff. Hi Henry. I see you're at home. Yeah, that's where I usually am. Why are you here? I didn't invite you. You did. On the 22nd. Oh, I did? I never voted nine days ago. Come in. So, what have you been up to? Oh, you know, just scheming. Oh, I love scheming. It's like my own favorite thing. What's the scheme? Okay, why are you holding a knife? Okay, why are you threatening me with a knife? <laughs> Jack, this is not appropriate for this situation. I don't know if you're- I, I'm not really fucking tired of this, Henry. I don't know what to make of that. I'm gonna run. Why, why isn't it turning? Why isn't it turning on? Why isn't the light turning on? Oh, thanks. Ah! Now raise this. Raise this. Pick this off a walkway. Uh, for now, stuff to throw. Can I go to the liquor cabinet? There's always stuff in there. Sure. If I can get that butcher knife over there. Uh... No. Jack, where, where the fuck is coming from? Oh, I don't know. Years of suffering, an immense amount of built-up rage, something along the lines of that. Oh, what? Dude, what have I ever done to you? Want to see how it feels, bitch? Want to see how it fucking feels? Gonna climb the stairs faster than me, you short fuck. I'm gonna chop your fucking legs off. Well, either way, you shouldn't be running upstairs with a knife. That's a good point, actually. This changes nothing. Oh, thank God. We went in opposite directions. Okay, so, uh, what the fuck? What the hell? Like, yours built of rage from, from what? Being short? And why is he taking it out on me? I mean, what have I ever done to him besides being a good and supportive friend? Okay, maybe I poke fun at him a little bit, but like, everyone does that with their friends. And maybe I've roughed his house a bit, and maybe I've like, grabbed his neck or 
twist his arm, but like, okay, that sounds bad. That can't be it. Oh, there was a time tracking down in the park in the middle of the night, uh, and he got arrested, but that was his choice. I had nothing to do with it. Oh, right, and the time I tricked him to win a game of chess and then became Grandmaster. That was so long ago, but who would have told me? Oh, there was a time I kissed him without permission. Uh, the time I screamed in his face. The time I sent him through a time warp. The time I watched him die. The time I murdered him. The other time I murdered him. Uh, the times I humiliated him and put him on the internet. And the time I waterboarded him. Okay, when you put it all together like that, it sounds like a bad friend, but I'm... I've been a bad friend. Fuck, I'm... I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I never wanted to... If you just told me before... It's not his fault. It's, it's my fault. I need to go apologize to him. Fuck. Jack! I want to apologize... Ah! Oh, right, that's still going on. Ah! Where's the last place you're trying to go to run away from him? The last place you would look. Oh, I know. He's on home. Okay, so knowing Jack, I give it about an hour until he gives up and comes home. That means I have an hour to prepare. First order of business, lock off all entrances. He cannot get in. Second order of business, set traps and ambush points in case the first order doesn't work. Alright, so what I've got to work with. Uh... Never again. Um, I need six or nine one more of these. Um, that seems like a bad idea. Okay, so I've got less than an hour to build a defense out of nothing that will stop a homestyle maniac in his own home. Oh god, oh fuck, I'm screwed. No, no, I'm not screwed. I just need to call in some help. Let's see, who's always there for me? Always able to help me out when you need a hand. Oh, I know. Hi, uh... Are you free right now? Uh, I'm in... I need some help. I'm in a situation. Uh, no, I'll, I'll explain everything when you get here. It's, it's a long story. But I, I need some help. Can you just... Uh, I'm up at Jack's house. Can you come over here? Um, oh, you're nearby? Oh, great. Alright, uh, I'll just come up here. Uh, I'll explain everything when you're here, okay? Alright, thanks. You're a lifesaver. Alright. See you soon, Jack. God damn it! Henry, I'm gonna get you! You're in the bathroom, aren't you? Come out, and I may even let you have some last words. Or second to last words, because your last ones will be ah, as I slice my knife cleanly across your freakishly long neck. You have such a way with words. There's nothing in here. Hi. Jack, I've been a bad friend. Ah! That's right. Jack, I've been a bad friend. Ah! God damn it. Jack, I've been a bad friend. No shirt. What? No shirt. What? No shirt. Hold on. If I do this, will you try to calm down and talk it out with me? Fine. What? Fine. What? Fine. All right, this is getting old. And if you're not gonna try to murder me anymore, clap your hands. Oh, that's right. I'm just gonna give you the benefit of the doubt. Jack, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'd be sorry if someone was trying to kill me with a knife too. Uh, but Jack, listen to me. I, I've been a bad friend and I, I need to apologize. 
Hmm. And how'd you reach that conclusion? I mean, the murder was a big part, but I really should have realized earlier. Jack, you're a really non-confrontational person. You put up with a lot of shit before you call someone out. More than you should. And I'm, I'm sorry. Jack, Jack, I shouldn't have grabbed your neck all throughout middle school. I shouldn't make fun of you every chance I have. I shouldn't waterboard you. Is there anything I'm forgetting? You stole my pencil in eighth grade. Wait, wait, I did? Oh. Here, have this one. That was already mine. God damn it, I did it again. <sighs> you know what, Jack? I shouldn't take advantage of your forgiving personality to make you the butt of every joke and make you do things that you don't want to do. I mean it, Jack. I... Jack, I'm sorry. Can you untie me? Sure. Dude, you're my best friend. You've been with me through a lot, and I really care about you. I just wish you told me to stop before you tried to murder me. Yeah, in retrospect, attempted murder probably wasn't the best way of going about that. Yeah, it was probably the worst way. I mean, it worked. Don't do it again. I won't. Dude, I care about you too. I'm sorry. <sighs> Can we read the old gentleman's behind us? No more in this torment. Sounds good. <sighs> Dude, I still feel bad. I can't take it off easy, you know? I did try to kill you. If for an hour. I tormented you for like six years. Okay, but like, I don't think it's right to no, just- no, None of this plays over crap. I'm- I was so bad to you. I. You can do anything you want to get back at me. Okay, but like, I- even if I can't think of any- Anything? Anything. Alright, here it is. Uh, I'm being waterboarded. Uh, Six I, years sure in this? the making, and I'll get Is this here. really what you, want, what you want to do? Yes. Uh, I do think it's the okay. ideal thing okay. to do. Have fun. Ah! Ah! <laughs> So how does it feel?